Welcome everybody. So today is day one of a three day ready reserve block and it is currently 1250. I'm number four on the list for those of us that are good for three days. So we'll see if I get used. They have already got people to sit airport standby until 945 central time. So a couple more hours to go to make sure there's someone at the airport until the last flight leaves tonight. Um, went grocery shopping, trying to clean up the house because we have company coming. And if you didn't know me, if this is your first time, my name's Elizabeth. I am a flight attendant for a major US carrier. And this is my last flying for the month of September. And yeah, so hopefully I've been catching up on videos and I should have one go out um, in the next 24 to 48 hours. And again, hopefully I've been catching up. So. Let's see if I get called. Stay tuned. All right, so I got a trip. It's a three day in A, but it's not too hard. Um, one tonight to San Diego, and then we work two or three to, to Nashville, and it's 21 hours in Nashville. I need 21 hours in Orange County. Disneyland Pass, Magic Key, <laughs> whatever. Um, so finishing up around the house, doing the dishes, picking up all that fun jazz. And then we'll leave in about two and a half hours. So I'll see you then. All right, so I got to drop Hannah off this morning and pick her up. So that was pretty good for Ready Reserve. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so I'm gonna go home and have to leave in about two hours. So, but it was nice being able to pick her up. I didn't really want a trip, I would rather have served airport standby for five hours and come home and slept in my own bed but oh well it actually feels Walk like fall I'm today doing. it's 59 and sunny Walk I'm doing. okay i'm gonna walk like hannah does all right so we're going to the airport hannah are you gonna take me to the airport mm -hmm. so we have friends in town and we want to loan them my car it's really bright right here so that that means that clint's got to take me to the airport we're about to head out. He's giving me his AirPods to try out. Um, so but we need to go. Uh, yeah, one to San Diego, short overnight in San Diego tonight. So that's what we're doing. Again, in a position, lead position, whatever. So it is what it is. All right, let's get the show on the road. Uh -huh. safety checks are done not completely full we have about 40 empty seats we're gonna be on our way to San Diego one and done all right so in San Diego um, pretty uneventful flight just what I like we were actually 20 minutes early we are here for a short overnight just shy of 11 hours so it's 7 35 we have to be in the lobby at 6 10 a.m. So tomorrow will be interesting because I guess there is a storm or weather uh, going through Pensacola, Florida, and we have to go through Pensacola, Florida. So we'll see what happens. I'm going to eat and go to bed. I'm tired because I was just, the past few days I've been catching up on housework and trying to clean the house for guests. And so oh, I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, good morning. Good morning, guys. It's AM, very AM. Um, I mean, it's not really that bad. It's like six. I have to go get ice for my food bag. And then we have three today. Ooh, harsh lighting. Um, trying to multitask. One to St. Louis, then we change planes, and we have a sit. And then two more to Pensacola. <laughs> two more after that. And rumor is there's weather in Pensacola. So we'll see. Um, yeah. <laughs> All right, I gotta find the ice. Thank you. 
St. Louis and I guess these gates. I don't think I've ever been to these gates. They're way far down. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go see if I can find food and a real potty. We have about an hour and a half on the ground here before we change planes. Okay, so I'm on the new plane and I'm gonna have a super fast lunch. I went to Burger King and got a burger and some french fries. On that last flight, we had someone who had a dog and the rule is for pets is they have to stay in the carrier under the seat. Well, this seemed to be a little bit of a challenge. She had him on his lap, so when I did final walkthrough, I was like, he has to go down in his carrier. And then when I came to do drink orders, she was trying to hide him under a coat. So that was a little bit of a struggle, but we made it and we're here. I'm gonna eat real quick, too fast, empty flights pretty quick. So, and then we'll be in Nashville. All right, I'll see you in a bit. All right, so I'm in the room in Nashville. I am so tired. I've been in the room for probably an hour. Um, right when I got to my hotel room, my mom called me because my five-year-old who um, was at her house was having a meltdown. My husband had some has some friends in town that are staying with us and they decided to go to a Rockies game and so grandma's watching the girls. Not a big deal, nothing different. Um, so, but Hannah was having a meltdown wanting me, wanting her dad, she wanted to go to the baseball game. And I was like, Hannah, you're gonna have more fun at Mimi's house. Baseball games are long and boring um, for a five-year-old who's just gonna wanna run around the stands. Um, yeah, that's a first that I've ever had to legit talk her off a cliff. Um, I don't know, I'm tired, 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 tired. So I know, I I love being a flight attendant. Um, I know that means I have to be away from my kids. Again, it's not as much as a lot of other working mothers because even though I'm gone overnight, um, like yesterday I got to walk her to school and pick her up, but uh, try not to have mom guilt about it. But you know, I work 12 days a month and that's not a lot. And normally when I'm not home, She's with my husband or my mom. We're really blessed with childcare situation like that. So I am tired. I've got ribs. I'm heating up some ribs in my hot logic. I'm drinking a water. And I think I'm gonna go downstairs and see if I can get something like a side, like French fries or something to go with my ribs. Um, yeah, but we're here for a really long time. I'm not going out tonight. It was kind of chilly and I only brought shorts. Um, so tomorrow, tomorrow, we don't have to be lot, we don't have to lobby till 3 p.m. So my goal is to go out and wander around tomorrow. So whew, I'm here, I made it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I will see you guys later. Good morning, YouTube. So I am up. It is, it's 11 something. <laughs> I stayed up way too late last night. 11:41. I stayed up way too late last night online shopping and looking at Instagram reels. So we have to be in the lobby at three. So I've got a couple hours, three hours, and I'm going to go find something to eat. Yeah. So let's go explore. <music> Nashville had a really good breakfast. So funny story about breakfast. 
I don't have a purse. I don't usually carry a purse. I just had my debit card in my pocket. So I got up to use the restroom and they bust my table. <laughs> and they felt so bad. So they brought me an extra pancake. I was pretty much done eating. So they brought me a pancake. So that was really nice. But I was just like, I just went in there. I thought you guys saw me. <laughs> and I goes, that just means you guys are Johnny on the spot. So I'm gonna walk around a little bit more for about an hour and then head back. All right, so I'm back in the hotel room. Obviously, I'm dressed in my uniform and I'm just um, moving some things around on my computer so I can do some editing, hopefully. I, we have two flights today, one to San Diego that's blocked for four hours and 25 minutes. Ew. So it'll probably be closer to the four hour mark, my guess would be. And then from, where did I say we were going? We're going from... <laughs> Nashville to Burbank, Burbank to Denver. So that's the plan today. Um, hopefully my C who got rerouted last night is supposed to deadhead in or somehow get to Nashville so that we'll be able to fly with him again. So I'm flying with two guys, the C, it's his first month online when we, we always say online when you first come on. So this is his first month. He worked for my airline on the ground in Boston and then he became in flight, he became a flight attendant. Um, he was in, I think one of the first or second classes of people that they had. When the pandemic happened, we had internal classes that were supposed to start and they canceled them. And then when the flying just shot through the roof post pandemic or whatever, when people decided to start flying, um, they started these internal classes again, and we're, we're going to have like two or three classes a month going, um, two or three classes going at a time. So they're really ramping up hiring. In fact, my carrier was hiring today. The website crashed. Classic. Um, so, and this is September. So if you're watching this, sorry. But so he's new. And so it's always a tradition for people on probation that the, the other crew members pay their van tips. So I've got $2 in my pocket so I can pay his van tip. And I'm excited for him. I'm excited for more people coming in to relieve us and help um, it not be so busy. And so I'm going to get finished packing up and head down and let's do two home to Denver. <music> from editing the video. It's December 23rd and I realized when I was editing this, I was just getting to the end, that I didn't say goodbye. I didn't wrap it up. So, goodbye. <laughs> it's December 23rd. Obviously, it's two days from Christmas. So I'm actually kind of happy I got to go come on and say Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. I hope you're having a wonderful um, Christmas break, winter break, whatever you guys celebrate but I'm almost caught up with all the videos. This is my last video from September. I didn't fly the whole month of October, so I'm slowly almost caught up. I know you guys are probably tired of hearing that, but if you guys wanna check out some other videos, they are down below, and I will see you guys on the next vlog. Bye.